Good morning from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. We've been jumping around quite a bit with the last few videos. We went from India to Paris. Uh, the last video is in the Calgary airport. And we have since spent a couple days back home with my parents in Saskatchewan. And now we're back at it again in Toronto. We did also go to Dublin and I went to Springfield as well in between. So in the last six weeks, it's a lot of places, a lot of cities. Yeah, bouncing around quite a lot lately, which is very exciting. It's what we like to do. Um, but this is also very exciting because this is a brand new place for us. Like despite me being Canadian, growing up in Canada, spending 25 years of my life here, I've never set foot in Toronto before, other than the airport, of course. Uh, so <laughs> that's never fun. No. <laughs> so this is pretty exciting that we're here. Even though we have never been here before, I actually have done very little research about what there is to do and see here. Usually I'm very into it. I'm online, I'm looking up all the restaurants to go to, I'm looking up um, all the major sites to see, things to do in the city, but I haven't done that for this trip. So we're kind of winging it, but we have a good plan for today. If the best thing there is to do in Toronto exists, it is to go to a Blue Jays baseball game, which is where we're heading now. found the stadium Rogers place I think it's called Rogers, Rogers Center Rogers Center yeah <laughs> we're so bad yeah we are we, we don't even know what we're doing we're just What's showing the, up the, is the hockey or what do we do <laughs> the stadium looks amazing so far though look at that and right under the CN Tower this is amazing We have to buy tickets. We thought we could buy tickets at the gate, but it's all online apparently, so quickly buying tickets now. It starts in like 15 minutes.
was so much fun. The Blue Jays lost, but it didn't really matter. It was great energy there. It was so much fun to see a game like that. I've never seen a professional baseball game ever. So yeah, that was so amazing. We're just taking a stroll around the stadium now because there seems to be a lot going on. We're right beside the CN Tower. Jeez, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's a pretty picture. I don't see any 3D. The 3D does it. It's not looking right with the 3D. I had no idea there was a public square like this in downtown Toronto. All these trendy bars, breweries these huge trains, the CN Tower, right by the Rogers Center. It's awesome. It's a great vibe around here. Like this is clearly like part of an old station. Yeah. Wow. How cool and trendy and open it is. All the old cars on display. They really, they really balance the old with the new here. Mm -hmm, that's true. It's Without very... destroying the old. Yeah, yeah. We're still keeping it cool. Yeah, this is an old station where they would turn the cars around. Oh my goodness, look at this waterfront. Wow, this area is incredible. Got canoes and kayaks over here, dozens of them. And we got the sailboats over here and over there, and then also motorboats over there. Amazing, there must be a lot going on on this lake. Oh my gosh, and a beach with all these umbrellas. That is so cool. Well, for a completely unplanned day in Toronto, I am very happy with how it turned out. We got lucky that there was a Blue Jays game on, had a great time in the early afternoon that we were lucky enough to get good seats for. So that was incredible in itself. I am very pleasantly surprised about this city. We had been coming here and I was thinking that it was just gonna be a giant city and there wasn't gonna be much to see, not much culture, but I feel like I couldn't have been more wrong. There's so much going on here from just what we've seen today. So we've got another couple days here and I'm super excited to explore around more.